And we'll soon get a break from loud, low-flying airplanes. Air traffic control has been sending planes in and out of Rochester, usually over the city, but there was a change a few weeks ago, and those planes have been going right over Brighton. News 8's Stephanie Golden headed to the airport to find out what's going on with all this. People who live in Brighton are noticing more airplanes in the area. I'd say five or six planes, you know, just bag like 10 minutes intervals, you know, and it's kind of annoying. And it's causing some unpleasant effects. You know, some days it's okay, and some days uh, it sounds like the plane is taking off right overhead. So it depends on the day, it depends on the time, depends on the pattern, but some days you think the plane is going to take off and fall right on you. Like it's it's louder earlier in the morning and later at night. Especially after the air, the air show that happened yeah, a few weeks ago. It seems like we paid attention to yeah. it more. Most people we spoke to didn't know why they were seeing more airplane traffic. Andy Moore, the director of the Greater Rochester International Airport, says air traffic patterns were changed to complete maintenance on the airport's main runway. That part of the project's over with. So traffic patterns get back to their normal uh, rotation using our main runway. Starting today, people will notice a decrease in airplane traffic and noise, which some say is music to their ears. It would make me happier, you know, some peace and quiet finally. Moore says the main runway was reopened today. There is still some landscaping and electrical work to be done that will be completed during off-peak hours. From the newsroom, Stephanie Golden, News 8. Thanks, Stephanie. More than 100 flights come through the airport each day. Fairly busy. Tonight is the kickoff for a very special football game, one that benefits kids who otherwise might 